what is it that you might think the people in your world are asking of you? Or to put it another way, what do you think they need from you? What are they needing from you? We could think of the world, the big world, part of which we've made reference to the floods in Pakistan, we could easily name other dire situations. And then there are the people immediate in our life, immediately in our life. It's very apparent to me that the people in my life, in my world, need something from me. They're asking for something from me. It's also true that there's an urge in me to give something to the people in my life. Thank God, I might say, was all need and no gift to give within me. That would be disturbing. And I do believe that within all of us, there is the urge to give what we have to give. Most of us find out pretty soon that we somehow have to access something more of ourselves to truly be of service to other people. That the first thing that might have come to our mind doesn't quite get us there, that there's something deeper, something more powerful to bring. We have, we could say, love to bring to others. And yet love has many dimensions. They may need the affectionate kind of love, which is a wonderful thing, human affection, beautiful part of life. And yet, there's more to love than human affection. We say love is a power. We have the power of love to bring to others, to empower them. I think of the people in my life, they need a little of the power of love. They need it from within themselves. But maybe there's something from me to remind them that that power of love is present. 